Hey, what's up you guys? If you're planning on towing a trailer with your Honda Pilot, you have to have trailer wiring installed. It's required by the law. Let's go ahead and break down that really easy install. You'll need the tools seen here to complete this installation. So we're gonna start off in the cargo area. Honda has a pre-wired plug right underneath the rear threshold panel right here. So we're gonna need to remove this. We're gonna start by pulling up on this flooring. And then to remove the rear threshold panel, we're just gonna pull up on it. And then we'll set this aside. So our plug is located right over here behind the storage tray on the driver's side. We're just gonna pull this back and then we have access to our plug right here. So now we're gonna take our plug and we're just gonna plug it into that connector. And then we're gonna tuck this extra wire into here. Now on our converter box, there's some double-sided tape. We're gonna take the cover off of this tape and we're going to tuck our converter box in between there as well. So let's talk about how to store your four flat harness. You can leave it in your storage area, just right here in the storage tray, and you can pull it out through the weather seal when you need to tow, or you can bring it underneath your vehicle and mount it next to your hitch receiver. To do that, we're gonna to need to get through this grommet right here. So to remove this grommet, we're just gonna pop it off with the flat head screwdriver. Now this will let us into the frame right here, and there's another grommet on the bottom side. We're just gonna go ahead and remove that. So now that we have a passage through, we're just gonna take our four flat harness and we're gonna push it underneath our vehicle. With our wire underneath our vehicle, we're going to modify our grommet to put it back into place. We're just gonna cut a slit in it halfway through. So we're gonna take our wire and we're gonna sit it into that slit and reinstall the grommet. Now we're gonna take our extra slack and we're just gonna tuck that in between our storage tray. Now that we're done in our cargo area, let's go ahead and put it all back together. Now we're gonna reinstall the grommet underneath our vehicle. We're gonna cut a slit in it just like we did up top. Now when leaving your four flat underneath your vehicle, a lot of people will like to just leave it dangling, but it can drag on the ground and get damaged. So we're going to mount it on our bumper using a four flat mounting bracket. You can pick this up at your closest U-Haul store or at uhaul.com, but it's not included with our kit. So we're gonna line it up on the bottom of the bumper, and then we're gonna drill our first hole using a 3 16 drill bit. And then we'll line up our bracket and secure it with the net. Now we'll just make sure that it's squared and we'll repeat on the second hole. And then we'll tighten up our screws using a 10 millimeter socket. And then we'll bring our four flat into the bracket. And then we'll secure it with the dust cover. With our wiring powered up and secured, you're ready to tow a trailer. Thank you for watching our video. If you have any questions about this product, or if you'd like to schedule an installation with a U-Haul Hitch professional, you can visit your closest U-Haul Hitch Center, or you can visit us online at uhaulhitches.com. Thank you.